very lives consist of moments, occasions, events, and experiences. But some of these moments turn out to be so special that you never want to forget them. Unfortunately, to forget is human, and time relegates all those special moments to antiquity. And that is when photography comes in to bring to the present memories of those special moments, occasions, and events which you cherish so, so much. You don't just want photography, you want professional photography. Speak to the experts at Dan Studios UK. A firm of professional photographers providing on equal photography services to all areas in the UK. Let us take care of the photographs of those special occasions that mean so much to you. Is it a wedding, a christening, an engagement, a marriage ceremony, a birthday party, or is it a funeral celebration, a business event, a religious event, a political event, or other social events. At Dan Studios UK is your ultimate choice. Get in touch now for a professional photography service with a touch of spice. At Dan Studios UK, incredible photographs that return those memories from antiquity to the present. A bushion for so occasion in your party, a man quenching for be a mess of pictures in a woo. Beat me because I'm sorry, or pictures in your say. Contact at Dan Studios UK on 078-52-311-049. That's 078-52-311-049. At Dan Studios UK for incredibly fabulous photographs. At Dan Studios UK. Naturally flawless. At Dan Studios UK. Incredible photographs with a touch of spice. spice, spice. Approaching for Ghana for listen to Ohima B this and every Tuesday evening 8 p.m. to 9 p.m. UK time for our evening talk show. A man come on. Chewajin. Join the conversation. Family issues. Social issues. Awari munsem. Child upbringing. Abataye munsem. A man titiye munsem. Fie shensem. A man masukahu. Don't miss this show. This and every Tuesday evening 8 to 9 p.m. UK time. Listen to a man come on, on top online. Radio UK. You can watch the program live on Facebook at Top Online Radio UK. You can tune in to us by visiting our website www.toponlinestation.com or you can download our radio app directly from the Play Store or the App Store. You can also tune in to us on Modern Ghana Radio, Ghana Web Radio page, mytuna.com and all third party radio platforms. Join the conversation what Jun Chen is saying, don't miss this show. This and every Tuesday, 8 to 9 p.m. UK time. Only on Top Online Radio UK. You don't want to miss this. Who is going to do my account and tax returns for me, Cra? Certified accountant. Certified accountant. Certified accountant. They will help you with your account and tax returns. Are you a medical driver, hairdresser, shop owner, or self-employed? Certified accountant. And I was working with Chapman. And then we say when you will be a what bring accounts and tax returns more. Now ban so more. Now who you are It didn't make careful. Certified accountant. And the amount. So F accounts and tax returns. Company accounts. Bookkeeping. Payroll services. Charity accounts. And gift aid claim. As of all, not ready. Open an internet. Certified accountant. self tax planning. Business advice. Company registration. And many more. And you should watch it. Company. What you want to say? Now what the hotel bill? What is the capital? What is the bill? No, Certified accountant. 
Say say a batter straight from the dia. What to do? Construction workers, agency workers, relief security workers, bank nursing staff. Any more who here? Juma, our temporary workplaces in Nigeria. Mon frano, no one is able to do my bomb. Me dey am dey cry and say H M R C four. I dey come back work. What you mean? Wow, H M. Anya say so. What is so cry? Address. 335-351 Raynam Road South Darknam RM10 8QR Telephone 0208-226-4933 Mobile 079-568-04517 Ah! Certified Accountant Me humba ma me humba chame Mudi mpunti yo Abba me duma yu It's the Expansion Summit 2022. The Apostolic Church International UK Area A presents Expansion Summit. Thinking of coming to Ghana now or later? Wondering where and how to go about your stay while in Ghana? Have you heard and want to experience Ghana from her food to music to culture to heritage and to tourist sites? Denilex Travel and Tours is ready to hold you down. Denilex Travel and Tours is your ultimate travel partner right from the airport to wherever your destination may be. Denilex is well equipped to handle your travel needs and be your guide throughout your stay in Ghana. Connect with us on social media at denilex underscore group or visit our website at www.denilexcompanylimited.com or call plus 233-744-431. The experience with Denilex Travel and Tours is always worth reliving. Try us. Denilex Travel and Tours, your ultimate travel partner. Next grill. Listen to DJ G Nice on Top Online Radio UK this and every Tuesday evening, 4 to 6 p.m. UK time. As he brings you an mixed player, what's in the mix? It's really anything goes. Social issues, cultural issues, diaspora issues, Ghanaian issues. It really cuts across all the board. Listen to DJ G Nice this and every Tuesday afternoon, 4 to 6 p.m. UK time. Don't miss this show. Join the conversation. What's going on? Next prayer only on Top Online Radio UK. You can listen to this program live on Facebook and YouTube. Just search for Top Online Radio UK. You can also tune in live on our website, toponlinestation.com. Download our free radio mobile app from the Play Store and the App Store. You can also get the download links from our website, toponlinestation.com. Don't miss the show. Join the chat. Join the conversation. Let's talk. Join TJT Live this and every Tuesday afternoon, 4 to 6 p.m. UK time. You don't want to miss this. This program is proudly sponsored by Certified Accountant Limited, a firm of Ghanaian accountants in the UK. You can reach them for all your accounting and tax matters on 0208-226-4933. That's 0208-226-4933. Or you can visit their website certifiedaccountants.org at certifiedaccountants.org. DJ Unice twice as much. For a brass, so it's time. It's time for in his presence. This is DJ KB Top Online Radio UK. I am in Chaka Sepa and a Bramobia Mobia Gana for Motiminka. I brass on a brass on for in his presence. I and trust some no a chair say my young empire border and Tia Bribia. I see on your miasm na your bomb pie and then you receive a twasso. Uh, your name Reverend Jacob Vanderpoy of the Wailing Intercessors Network. And I'm a bit of a man. 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 
Welcome to In His Presence. Reverend Jacob Vanderpoy, how are you, sir? I'm blessed. I'm blessed by the grace of God. Always. We thank God. Hmm. Every day I say I will surprise you uh, with, uh, yeah. in your team, your, your network. But it is yet to happen. Um, hopefully, yeah, <laughs> at some point, it yeah. will happen. All right, Reverend Minister. Let's hear what the Lord has for us. Thank you. Thank you, DJ KB. Thank you, the top online team. Amen. I want to just thank God for your life, Amen. for your dedication, and the good work you are doing for the whole public. Amen. Also, I want to welcome you, dear precious one. It is good to join us to go before his, pre his presence. For in his presence there is fullness of joy. Whatever you are going through, the Lord will put a joy in your mouth. And the Lord will saturate you with his anointing. Amen. Dear listener, just like DJ KB said, share it and let somebody join in the nuggets of God's word. All that we are saying is Jesus' word. We've been talking about the Sermon on the Mount. It's just like Jesus introducing us to the Christian word. He came not to fulfill and not to uh, abolish the law, but the fulfillment and to teach us. And he taught us how to live as Christians. Shall we pray? Amen. Our Heavenly Father, we give you thanks and adoration. Lord, we are so grateful. Your word says, let everything that our breath praise the Lord. You are feet and kicking. You are breathing. Even if you have some complication, the hand of God will reach you wherever you are. Amen. The message of God be your portion tonight. And as you hear the sound of my voice, you hear the sound of DJ KB's voice. May the Lord speak to you in accent clear to you. May the Lord commit you unto his word. Father, mm -hmm. we invite you, for we pray that we will not speak the enticing words of man's wisdom, but the mm -hmm. power and the Holy Spirit will be demonstrated here. I pray mm -hmm. that God will give you a hearing here and a listening act so that all shall work together for your good. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Amen. We are praying Amen. with thanksgiving. Amen. So, thank you, Reverend. Um, I think so we, we are still on the, um, is it the Sermon on the Mount? Yes. So That's, carry on, mm -hmm. sir. Thank you. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Like I, I just said a minute ago, the sermon of on the mount was a profound uh, message or a a preaching, a teaching of Jesus Christ in fulfillment of the uh, Old Testament principles. Is to fulfill the law, not to abolish the law. 
and so far we've done many 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 areas we've done the uh, beatitudes we've done righteousness we've done uh, a, a christian being like a salt or a, a, a light we've done a uh, 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 we've done uh, many, many areas like uh, moral purity and so on. And last week we did, uh, we did marriage. Our title was Divorce and Fide Fidelity. Yeah. And we said God instituted marriage. And marriage is sacred. And marriage is bounding. And there are implications that come in the way. We read the scripture that says, uh, before a person is divorced, he should be given a certificate of divorce. Uh, but we saw that Jesus said, marriage, when two comes together, it is an agreement that God has made. So divorce should not be taken lightly. God is divorced. And uh, a, a, a person can be divorced or a, a man can divorce the wife except when a person is found in adultery. Even so, it depends on the individual. If you want to forgive and move on, that's fine. We saw that we should be considerate in our marriages. We saw that there should not be comparison here and there. Because most of the time, through the comparison and other things, it leads to separation. And we, we saw that problems in marriages can be solved when we open up. Open up in prayer. Change your line of communication. Godly counsel. You need godly counsel. And we establish the fact that fidelity is about truthfulness and trust. But we make some few statements like a man is doing something and the wife doesn't know. A wife is doing something and the man doesn't know. That doesn't bring trust. So today we want to open up. Marriage is greater than the feeling of love. Mm. Love is good, but marriage is a covenant, and it should not be go. Uh, 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 we should not go into it lightly. Mm. 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 So today it leads us to Matthew chapter five, verse thirty-seven to thirty, uh, verse thirty-three to thirty-seven. And it talks about oaths, vows, and honesty. And let's see what the Bible says and how Jesus taught us to do. So when we read Matthew chapter 5, 33 to 37, we will be hitting on the road. All right. Rabbi Minis, I will look for um, that version. Uh, my one is still... A new King James Version. So, um, okay. I hope that is okay, uh, Matthew. That's five. very fine. That's very right, fine. Let me bring the. Um, I think I have the quotation here. Yes. Mm -hmm. So Matthew chapter five, thirty-three. Thirty-three to thirty-seven, sir. Right. I read. Matthew 5, Again, you have heard that it was said to those of old, you shall not swear falsely, but shall perform your oaths to the Lord. But I say to you, do not swear at all, neither by heaven, for it is God's throne, nor by the earth, for it is his footstool, nor by Jerusalem, for it is the city of the great king, nor shall you swear by your head, because you cannot make one hair white or black, but let your yes be yes, and your no 
no the last um, verse 37 but let your yes mm -hmm. be yes and your no no for whatever is more than this is from the evil one amen 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 uh, men or human being who go to the extent to want to swear to prove the point that what he or she is saying is right and in the old testament it was their practice mm. but jesus was saying as a child of god or as a christian let your yea be yea and your no be no if you know between your god that what you are saying is the honest thing i quite remember we were talking about something in the on this program and i was saying at times we don't have to prove a point you you are accused of something when they call you tell them what you know tell them you are not the one but when they try to accuse you and you try to defend that's where we go into swearing and swearing if you are not very careful because you are hitting heads you use some words that is not godly yeah yes but uh, jesus was uh, the the uh, session is talking about swearing goes beyond you being a uh, dependent on god mm. you are taking the situation into your hand okay oh if i'm accused to do something i said dj kb i wasn't the one who did it mm. i've proved my point it's either you take it or not yes or at the back of your mind if i'm telling lies it is between me and my god yes it is between me and my god mm. but uh, because of human nature human nature and that is where we we are not trusting god mm. and the session is talking about oath and uh, swearing uh, uh, it goes beyond oath and vows. Oath and vows, if you try to differentiate oath and vows, or if the session of swearing, you have anything to, let me expatiate more or so, you can come in before we move to vows and oaths and honesty. All right. Reverend Minister, I think I have a, a, a question there, uh, especially mm -hmm. when it comes to, uh, you know, when it says swearing. You know, in this country, mm -hmm. um, I think probably they have a different meaning uh, for the term swearing. It's like mm -hmm. when somebody uses the F word. Foul word. Yeah, that is when mm. they say, oh, he... he why are you swearing at me? So, can you tell me the difference between the context of the word swearing in the in the, for instance, in the British context, uh, as um, compared to the use of the word swear in the biblical uh, context? Sir? I would say their point goes to be right because biblically, you are not to swear because when you are to swear. You've gone to the level of taking the situation into your hand. Okay. And you can use any language. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, the other point goes to the extreme, but it, it is a lie because uh, biblically you are not to swear. And somebody who wants to swear will, 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 can go all out and use any language, mm -hmm. it will be foul it will not be right against god maybe it won't be the british meaning proper but he will say something that is not pleasing in the sight of god mm. you mm. see mm. so that is the context and it's in line with what the british are saying so both, 
Context that, is not good uh, for a Christian. It's not good. Mm, swear it's not good. You may not. And all that is not good. And also, it's see not those good. Foul he said, don't swear by my, my stool. Don't swear by my throne. So you you may be adding towards the F word. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So that's where the border lies. I think um, it's a good point. That, I hope it's yes, sense. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah. Um, the reason I asked that question is that you know, for us to get clarity between those two contexts, and yeah, sometimes yeah. people use F words and you ask them, and they say, Well, well, I'm not swearing to God, so I should be yeah. fine. I'm just talking to that person because what the person did was, mm. was wrong, you know, yeah, <laughs> so I'm not, you know, reviling God, it's just a human being I'm reviling, so and uh, that, that shouldn't be a problem. So I think it's good and mm -hmm. we thank you for clarifying for us that both <laughs> contexts of the word swear is not good for us as Christians. I think that yeah. Uh, yeah. that, that, um, that is yeah, the bottom, the bottom line. line of the whole issue. Thank <laughs> you very much, sir. Yeah. I, yeah. As a Christian, say no to it. Oh, I didn't do it. Mm -hmm. They may have all their suspicion. Mm -hmm. And they will think, oh, don't mind him, he's pretending. Leave it to God. Mm. At God's own time, he may prove it to them. Even if God doesn't prove it, he knows in heaven that you are not guilty of what they are accusing you. Okay. All right. Yeah, so the word, uh, when uh, there is some 15 verse 1 to 4, we may when we attempt to swearing, we take all uh, it comes down to oath and vows, and we want the biblical aspect of these two words and honesty. Oath, when we say oath, oath can be made to man, mm -hmm. uh, uh, to man in the presence of God. Okay, oath. And oath is taken between men, or uh, is taken when, for instance, to an organization or to a country. For instance, when a, 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 a leader is elected to a country, is made to take an oath. Okay, all right. Yeah, yeah. or. Uh, you can take an oath to somebody. In, I mean, this, but vows, in this country, I think, uh, um, when you are naturalizing to become a British mm -hmm. citizenship, a British citizen, sorry, um, I think they, they make you swear, is it an oath, isn't it, that you are now relinquishing your nationality to your former country and you are um, pledging your allegiance to the United Kingdom. Mm -hmm. So I don't know if that that's is another it. example of um, oath. Uh, that's an example of oath. Okay. You are made king to the country. Okay. You are denouncing your your former country, mm -hmm. your country of birth, and you say, "Now I pledge, I, I promise to be uh, faithful to Britain." <laughs> yeah. No, no, no more to Ghana. <laughs> and. <laughs> <laughs> no more to God. <laughs> and uh, 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 the difference between it is that vows are made to God alone. Okay. Vows. And even in the court, as a Christian, they give you the Bible. And uh, even though you are talking to a man, you are making it in the name of God. Yeah. That becomes a vow. And in the consecration or the ordination of a uh, priest mm. or pastors we vow we are not vowing to the church but we are talking to god whose servant we are that i promise to be faithful mm. it comes from god down to the congregation or to man you are you are called as a servant of god okay you you a god's servant god's representative who is to serve a local church 
So you are representing God. So all the exchanges we make is telling the public that I will speak on behalf of God. Wow. Anything that I say mm -hmm. is coming from God. Wow. That's why we don't go into it lightly. Wow. That, that is a, 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 I think that is a very big issue. That, um, <laughs> That's a big issue. Um, you you mm -hmm. pledge to speak the mind of God to your people. The mind of God. So when we, we find some men of God asking for money before they deliver, does that... Mm -hmm. Mean those things that's are the question, coming from yeah. God. That's the question. A, a, a man of God can be blessed, but when you do it, that uh, you are coming to see me, there is a consultation fee and so on. That's where <laughs> it becomes it becomes questionable. Yeah. Honestly, it becomes questionable. Mm. There are the situation those who don't even take consultation fee, they get more than other people. Yeah. Very, because very true. genuinely, if, if J, uh, DJ KB comes to me and by his own will wants to give me, people give cars, people give houses and so on. That is from their heart. Yes. But when you work gimmicks on the life of people, that's why the Bible says, to whom much is given, much is required. Mm. Yeah. yeah. To whom much is given. So, setting responsibilities when we are not ready, we, 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 should, we should be careful a bit. We should be careful. All right. And if I, if I read uh, Psalm 50, maybe verse 1 to 4, it will establish something. Okay. Yeah. Psalm 15. 15 oh, yes. Uh, yeah, I got that one so that I can read them. I got 15, so ah, okay. I open. 15. Yeah, Psalm 15, 1 to 4. Lord, mm -hmm. who may abide in your tabernacle? Mm -hmm. Who may dwell in your holy hill? He who walks uprightly and works righteousness and speaks the truth in his heart. He who does not backbite with his mouth nor does evil to his neighbor, nor does he take up a reproach against his friend, in whose eyes a vile person is despised, but he honors those who fear the Lord. He who swears to his own head and does not change. Amen. Amen. So this is connecting. Mm, yeah the believer we have talked a lot about taking vow that comes to the uh, 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 minister or a pastor or a priest yeah. but it comes down to the christian jesus is talking that you you say something and you don't not change okay because people say things lightly mm. that's where we come to honesty and honesty, we won't say uh, only ministers, only uh, pastors, only priests. If you are a child of God, your yea should be yea and your no should be no. Amen. Honestly, I have people I know. If they tell me yes, I will take my time. <laughs> I will be very careful. And no suspicion have related to them years and years and i have the holy spirit this their yes is a yes <laughs> wow honestly mm. and if you really reveal god or you have reverence for man you will not tell man just something that area I would say personally, I'm very, very afraid for that thing. Mm. I, I, I like people telling straight. Yesterday we were in a meeting, some meeting. There was somebody, we were appointing her to something. And she 
elaborate to us. Do to this and that and that and that. I can't do what you are telling me. I can't. And that, those are the people I love. Mm, they will tell you. And that's what I do. Mm. You may think, oh, Jacob should be able to help me. But I bet if I can't do it, I'll tell you straight. Yeah, and that also has, um, someone would say, a subculture, has created a subculture among some people <laughs> that <laughs> instead of telling you, I'm sorry, I can't do it, they will say, oh, I will do it. And they won't mm -hmm. do it. Sometimes I, I find it a bit strange because some people, and a couple of times people have um, done it to me, and I ask myself, am I a, very, a scary person that, you know, mm -hmm. <laughs> if I ask you something and you think you can't do it, you cannot tell me straight, and so I'm sorry, I, I'm busy, I can't do it. But they will say, oh, yes, I will do it. But then I'll do it. the time will reach, you know, and you call them and, you know, they are nowhere to be found. So I ask myself, what is it? In fact, personally, I ask myself, so I ask people, am I scared, <laughs> you know, that people are scared <laughs> to tell me things in the face? So I think <laughs> um, it is also part of this thing we are, we are talking. That there is nothing like a small mm -hmm. lie and, and a big lie. You know, you yeah. know in the, in the, at the bottom of your heart that you cannot do it. Your answer is no. But you tell the person yes. You know, for instance, an example, um, you are trying to, you know, arrange a program with somebody. The person say, oh, mm -hmm. yes, I will do it. At that mm -hmm. very moment, do you need a person? You call them and their phone is off. Their phone is off and it's made an appointment yes. with you. So sometimes I really, you know, ask them, so why I try to find and on one occasion, some somebody opened up to me and said, well, uh, I'm not very good at, you know, those things. I said, well, but, you know, you could have just told me, you know. You should have told me. Yeah, because <laughs> that was a lie. Because you said, yes, I would do when in your heart, you know, it, it, you can't. Mm -hmm. You know, I think sometimes I think we have to be very careful and, you know, about sin. Yeah. You know, sometimes we, 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 we belittle some sin, but there's nothing like a small sin and a yeah. big sin. Mm -hmm. That is an, uh, one it's way true. of telling a lie. When you know That's at the it. time you are saying yes, you know in your heart it is a no. That is a lie. Mm -hmm. That is a sin. So I think we must be careful mm -hmm. as Christians that we don't lose sight of these petty, petty, petty things because they can cost us mm -hmm. dearly, you know, our salvation. Thank you very much, sir. Amen. 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 And to add to it, Somebody is wants me to do something for him on Saturday, and he should come to me. But I said to him, "Let's call on Wednesday and confirm it." Mm -hmm. I, I know definitely on my side, I've booked Saturday for it. But like you said, some who put their phone off. Yeah, I say. Call me Wednesday, and lo and behold, the person knows. If he doesn't call Wednesday, I will call him and say, I have mm -hmm. devoted my Saturday for you. Don't mess it up. Okay. Yeah. That's mm -hmm. it. So, at times, when you are doing something like that, people, like you said, people find you to be too particular about things. Yeah. But that's not. Case. Yeah, it is very, That's very not the true. Case. It's very, very true because you know. That's not the case. Yeah, and I don't understand why you know some people will say, well, uh, at one time somebody gave me an answer that um, some people they they feel shy to say no. You say, wow. Mm. I don't know if I'm alone, Reverend. Do you see people who feel so shy? It, it, there are people no. like that. Honestly, when they, there are there are people like mm. that. That's why I can confirm it. They think when they say no to the type of thing you are asking them to do, you will see them to be, you will belittle them. Mm. You see? At times, some of the things they think, oh, this can, it should be done by everybody. This can be done by everybody. 
and you know yourself that you are not prepared to do that thing or you are not capable at the moment tell the person mm -hmm. that because of this and that i don't have the confidence so maybe let's give it a time or at this very time i can't do it some people that why is true yeah, but, well anyway i, I hope i'll just ask one question last question regarding this so we don't we don't yeah. want that um digress, digress. I'll give you yeah. for instance i i you know let's say i up advertise for a job um you apply mm -hmm. um you're going to see the job i ask you can you do the job do you want the job mm -hmm. the person say yes oh yes and there was a time another one one candidate oh i love the job <laughs> i love the job <laughs> so she made me so confident that this person will turn up lo and behold on mm -hmm. the day i've informed the client that you know this person will be attending you know to my shock yeah. and surprise the person did not show up there was no person the, the, the client <laughs> called me i called this person the phone was off so i asked myself so what's mm. going on here you are you could mm. have been you are not uh you know in front of me to be scared of me you are somewhere we are mm. talking on phone couldn't you have just said yeah. i'm sorry i can't do it so find somebody else that's it yes that's but you it. say oh yes i love it i love the job <laughs> making me so you know i've been <laughs> I, I, I told other people uh, or somebody has taken the job i've got somebody yes. already no on that day it's did not, i not show point. up i called the person phone off anyway probably i think this question um i thank you for your explanation but it still it still baffles me why some people you, you know do it <laughs> when they, they they can do it you know anyhow I, but anyways let's carry on sir <laughs> We take authority over shyness. Amen. You that are hearing us, let your yea be yea and your no be no. Amen. If you know your words is, you can't honor the thing, find a polite way and tell the person. So let's learn from this. It helps society and it brings a forward going. Amen. Honesty is about the quality of being honest. Your yes is yes. They know there are people, like I said, if they tell me wait, I will go. I will quickly go. <laughs> if they tell me wait here, mm. before they will, they won't come in. 90% mm. of them, they won't come. Mm -hmm. They will waste your time. They've told you wait here. So you better go. Mm. Or they've told you two o'clock. Some by three or four that they will ring you. I'm somewhere I'm coming. Mm. It's our timing. <laughs> so African timing. Let, let, let's be careful. Yeah. Honesty is an attitude of the heart. It's not what we say. It's what we say and do. Mm. What we say rather tell who we are that's also a point but if you have related to a person to some extent or even in a family or in a society when they know you and you open your mouth intelligent society will have a backup mm. they will have a backup or there is somebody to when he says they say the job is done and we uh, to everybody hearing us there are exceptions at times you can give a promise that on that day or along the line something will happen also relate back to the people yeah but if you have promised dj kb i have promised him to come on this program on monday and monday by seven something is beyond control shouldn't i call him and say oh dj i know our program is coming on at eight o'clock yeah. 
But this is a situation unavoidable. Mm. But rather to put my phone off and he will go on air or he will be calling me and nothing will come out. Mm. Brothers and sisters in the Lord, let our yea be yea and our no be no. Honesty is an attitude of the art. Key to honesty, love the truth. Protect against deception. Love the truth. Amen. Honesty is to love the truth. At times the truth is painful. Mm. And the tr uh, uh, truth becomes a bitter pill. It cannot be swallowed. If I'm in the wrong, there is a point to that the presentation. But I should give allowance that I should be told that the way you are going, the truth must be told. There is that other aspect to, oh, it's because he's a pastor. He's going wrong. Uh, we can't say it. Hmm. We don't say, don't go and be disobedient and talk to somebody anyhow. Yeah. But there is a way that we can go. So, uh, a key to honesty is love the truth. There are scriptures, but our time is fast. Yeah. Second Thessalonians 2, 10 to 11. Protect against deception. I want us to go to types of dishonesty. Okay. <laughs> Deceiving others is dishonest. Hmm. Deceiving others. Telling me you, I will do this. Some, at the time that they are telling you, they know very well they won't do it. I think I will want to come in here, Reverend Minister, and I think I will <laughs> be a bit hard on some of our men of God. Some of our men of That's God, it. when they tell you, I mean, things and they are the word the Lord says, when in fact the Lord had said nothing. And mm -hmm. I think it sometimes it gets out of hand. I have one example. Mm -hmm. When um, the early days of my life in this country, and I was listening to mm -hmm. one radio, and, mm -hmm. um, and uh, the, uh, a pastor was ministering. I'm I'm sorry I'm being hard on pastors to, tonight, but uh, no, no, we have to come out with things that will uh, put people yes. right. We are not saying. We are saints in a mm. way. All right. Thank you, sir, for giving me the <laughs> opportunity. Mm -hmm. Go <laughs> ahead. I okay. love it. So, uh, somebody phoned in, and the person's line was bad, but the man of God heard a bit about, you know, we heard the voice of that person, and the mm -hmm. person had. A very a very lean uh, let me say soft voice so the man of god thought it was a lady or a woman mm. then the next mm. thing the man of god said oh yes somebody you are my last caller the holy ghost just told me you are a woman you are my you are going to be my last mm. caller and uh, you were trying to call but the line was not good so it dropped i hung up and called back the holy ghost just told me right now that you are my last caller you are a woman and this person called back the same soft voice and the man of god said hello um sister how are you and the, and the, and the, the person said um, i'm a man who <laughs> <laughs> yeah i'm sorry my voice is like that but i'm, I'm a man and this mm -hmm. man of god said oh i will say it in our language because that is the only way was say, oh what my yeah. man Oh, what my magua? It's like um, mm. I don't know how to uh, interpret it, but uh, explain it. It's like mm -hmm. I hope, brother, you understand. What my magua? It's like you are yeah. playing a game, and you know, um, you you lost it. You lost it. You know. You lost yeah, it. So, in fact, I was so so shocked and said, "Wow, is that how some men of God work?" So they're using psychology. 
Because when the person mm-hmm. called, mm-hmm. he told, uh, he saw that you know he heard that it was a soft voice. Then he said, mm-hmm. "Oh, the Holy Ghost told me that um, uh, you are a woman. You just try to call, and so call back mm-hmm. the Holy Ghost." That is where what you know uh, <laughs> shocked me. He said, "The Holy Ghost told me, just told me, that you are a mm-hmm. woman. You are trying to call the line dropped, so call me." So, Reverend Minister, I still don't understand. Why can a man of God? This is part of lying, you know. Right now, I mean, this I think is is to the highest all level, lying against the Holy Spirit, mm-hmm. isn't it? Saying the Holy Spirit mm-hmm. just told okay. you, when the Holy Spirit has mm-hmm. ne- not told you anything, Reverend. No, it, it never said anything. So I mm-hmm. want to understand okay. why to why is, uh, some some of our people doing th- these things. Are they not? They don't know. Don't they know uh, yes. the consequences of these things? To how to this example you gave in one of yes, our I, I, I'm still so not well. satisfied. Yes. <laughs> I don't understand. We we start <laughs> we started by saying mm-hmm. vows. You made a vow yes. to God that I will only speak the truth and only the yes. truth. If you are not conniving or lying, you could have said, if you did not, honestly, I can talk to somebody without saying the Holy Spirit told me, and when she or he comes to the light, I say, oh, are you a lady? Or you are a lady? Mm -hmm. With that, if uh, if you get it wrong, there is nothing wrong about it. You just say, oh, your voice look like a lady. But the moment you say the Holy yes. Spirit told me, that's where, that's where it's alarming yes. and it's Because scary. if it was truly the Holy Spirit, the, God, the Holy Spirit would have known <laughs> that it is <laughs> a man. The Holy Spirit will not get it wrong in that any is way. It. So it was your that own is sin. It. <laughs> and it, it it looks like it happens so, a lot. It happens a lot, and I ask myself. So, anyways, we will carry on, Reverend Minister. I think our time is time for prayer. <laughs> so, mm. a word to a wise mm. is enough, and God is in heaven, yes. and He hears and He knows our heart. So I pray that you and I, our hearts shall be twined to God. Amen. We will listen to God. And I say, deceiving others. Some, they deceive even themselves. (laughs) You know you are not up to the task. And you know you you don't have what it takes. There's a difference between faith. But this very person who deceives himself or herself, he knows, oh, at the last point, I I cannot do Mm -hmm. it. Then, he will, he will put himself yeah. up. So let's be careful. And the highest one that uh, clarifies your point, deceiving mm-hmm. God. Deceiving God. Trying to deceive <laughs> God. You can't deceive God. <laughs> yeah. Let me put it right. Trying, Trying to. to deceive God. <laughs> Trying to. Because you can't deceive mm-hmm. God. He knows your heart that you are going to lie before you lie. Yes. So you can't deceive him. I can deceive you. You can deceive me. Because I'm not God. Mm. But you, uh, we try to deceive God. So that one is a serious mm. note. Out of the overflow of the heart, the mouth speaks. I I think we are getting to now. Yeah, I, I think know. it's time for prayer. Yeah. Yeah. Um, uh, next week we will continue yes, this yes. session. We haven't gotten anywhere at <laughs> all. It's time for prayer. And Father, we call upon you Amen. concerning honesty, concerning the vows we make, concerning the commitment we make to one another. Amen. May we be honest with ourselves. Amen. Let your yea be yea and your nay be nay. Lord, nobody will hold you responsible if you cannot do it 
let them make mockery of you. You've spoken the truth. Yes. But don't go and put yourself up whereas you cannot do it. Lord, be merciful upon all of yes. us, especially we, the leaders, we, the uh, 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 clergymen. Yes. We use ourselves as a point of contact. Amen. For uh, we are human. So let's behave as representatives of Amen. Christ and say what God says. Amen. The Lord strengthen you tonight. Amen. Wherever you are sick, may the Lord depend on your word, your honesty, your commitment, your devotion to one another and make you strong. Amen. May your heart speak the truth. The truth and only by the Amen. truth. Father, O oh God, we commit our lives to you. And we pray that in all situations, we will look to Jesus. Because he is the altar and the finisher of our Amen. faith. We pray that through faith and patience, we will inherit the promises of Amen. God. If you want to come to Jesus, let's share a word of prayer. Amen. No man cometh to Jesus and go the same. If you come to him, he will not cast you out. Say after me, is the Lord's prayer, is the sinner's prayer. Dear Heavenly Father, I am sinful. Maybe I have been, I have been dishonest here and there. I come to you just as I am. I'm a sinner who cannot save uh, myself. Mm -hmm. But God come into my life. Be my savior. Be my Lord. Turn my life around. Amen. Let the spirit of God take control. In Jesus' mighty name, you are a new creation. All the old has gone. The new has come. God bless you. You are born again today. We thank God for the uh, uh, TV station. We thank God for our presenter Amen. as well. God bless you all. And we meet on next week, uh, next week Monday. Thank you very much, uh, Reverend Minister. Amen. Um, shall for us, Reverend um, Jacob Van der Poy of the Whaling Intercessors Network. So, Reverend, tonight I want you to um, take a few minutes to um, tell a bit about your prayer network and how um, people can join or. Um, what so, sort of support you can you will give um, to people? Thank you, sir. Thank God. Thank you for this opportunity. The Whaley Internet uh, uh, Network is a prayer team. A prayer team. Okay. Mainly on Wednesdays, at the moment, we have a Zoom meeting from 7 to 7.30. We have a link we've sent to people who are ready to be with us. And every morning, I, we send prayers to various contacts we have on our phone and through WhatsApp every morning, 10 to 15 minutes prayer as the law leads. And our doors are open to anybody it's not about prayer alone. If there is a form of counseling, there is something by the grace of God, like we are saying, honestly, we can lead you or we can pray with you. So uh, the numbers are with uh, top yeah, of line. At the moment, um, it's on the screen at the moment. Um, I put, yeah, your number oh, is on the screen. The, so. the, the number is on the yeah. screen. Feel free to call Reverend Jacob Vanapoy. If you call Jacob Vanapoy, uh, behind us, we can talk. And it's a transparent thing. Prayer and no gimmicks. No gimmicks. Mm. Thank, Thank you, you very much, sir, for your time. May God the Lord bless. richly bless you. May he replenish you. And may he increase his anointing and grace upon your life. Thank you very much, sir. So... Thank you, we'll, sir. We'll, we'll see, see you, you next week. week. Thank you. Bye-bye.
Bye bye. Okay. Bye bye. 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 Bye so if you you know won't quite sorry cry i will encourage you find some bible believing church you know the court now it is sending a bible kind of trust and kind of it is appointed unto man to die once and after that judgment so and we all have one life and the abusia baby in fear would say naka winning the be a bit messy at any time. Then if you share a pofu, umranti prim, and sana da boneno, I day abba. I program me every Monday in your mre, 8 to 9 pm UK time. To Mr. Russian also. So say, dear, it has a clock on the end of the gunner for you know, you tell me about it. I shall not supply every Monday, right. And then be able to see me out of my china somewhere when him Tuesday, dear. I ready, you know, a year, a year, but to boot to boot to boot to. I two live shows, Eddie Kai, DJ G Nice, the I I Miss Grail, ever brain, um, six, no, four to six p.m. Miss Grail, DJ G Nice, I will know DJ KP in Tisha no song. Send him one when him topics, new Diana, a dog super, be brave. And I make a date and join DJ G Nice I on the mixed grill I program no. And uh, the same Tuesday night you mre and you mre and you mre or he might be and so the man come over bremo. The man come over he might be the man come over bremo. And Tim Straw don't miss it. Now it's now so so case or he might be the banner. I will tell you a crab yachre me. Now, I was sure you can't miss it. And some big pa. <laughs> and all he might be what they ever. Ain't he be strong? Shannon, so tomorrow, 8 to 9. I said, cry there. He said, Tab, no. I think I could go through 10. Go and come on here. That's how he might be. Produce at the 10. Now, so cry. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. Ah, he said, last week, say, oh, my God, I bought 10 crap. I uh, uh, make a date now. Tune in. I'm here at my Ochina. I'm here for 8 p.m. UK time sharp. I incredible map now. Are you ready? DJ uh, can say, Oh, he may be so ready. Team, you know, I have to share them soon. I now be on so now. I can say, I think I will be to just say, I'm top online ready. You can say, Yeah, try a shimu. And to say, We are gonna need what you can have. Say, you are interested. When it's a radio, you want to say whether self or so your presenter and a host and a panelist get in touch with us. Now, you know, in Nkomo, a person trial shim. I and I'll be also say the brand new program air bar every day. So I have to do a quantum moon sum. A quantum moon sum. A brand new obese tear rubber. I new brand new uh, 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 kind of say program I did by a few days so I we are planning to be Fridays I fear the numre and numre I ain't look forward for it I plan to move some day so that we know and some big pa ain't he yeah the and also air bar I ain't he yeah but yeah now yes I I I can kind be upset. So, who tie a program to maybe a who person who sponsor any of our programs? Now, maybe a we do maybe a maybe a we do maybe a we bomb the room our I our doors are open. So then we need no radio do maybe any sponsorship neko. Enti so who do maybe a person who bomb the room our na also to sponsor a program be a freeing I na yeni enkomo. I said, yeah, yes, so basically, I in Sakon and Saba, a bit to me, I bought with you, my home, De Luna, and Pimpa Mutti, Topolan Radio, Mosuati, Unka, a Jumacra, we hear 
I almost saw a bit me at the Unka na and no apua a promo to I would you mano. I and Timmy saw a shadow super. I'm waiting for DJ KB na and Sana no, I'm say one day can you may you may D. You may call almost sponsor in a certified accountant limited certified accountant limited and to say oh you can hear this oh here accountant i'm now your tax returns at the amount certified accountant or more and i recommend your amount or we are gonna for ah i am gonna cast a beer with me a car i will call a mobile juice so eh yeah you ready and yeah i brought for 10 team beer you can know who i will come in and I who know now because I be a person could be a no I na omo eti mi abuwa o so wa person could be with Juma person we we charity in sorry sorry a person claim gift aid ni ni na omo ye e hu e Juma enti shenon so shenon so shenon so ni ami a duma Tuesday Wednesday is your time for legal matters I ni wise mad solicitors e ye sa Juma. Na we dey here to ask them be sase. Inti and Professor Charles here, hey, asemu UK. New Prime Minister in a videos be on Professor Charles here, you find who na. Eh, ebusa. We shall be pay. Obedi how many months in the office? Ha. Eh, asemu. Inti ujo unse we shall be pay obeche. Anyways, Sam, send me a omo every year. Kusi kwa ting. Ah, ubi a o conference. Oba send me a typo ni P60 at all. Papa yusu ba ya rushi sunak. To fasha si a video bi. E bi nukwa de e i omo de shop bi ne groceries. Aku gu na i no maten. No mo ya ne bi zan na bi so. Video be a buy, then crop four, and no more or more just a month. No matter how far, now Miss A, I will see a four. My come on, no, ain't he a tear for? How do you see the life that I mean the length of the term of this new prime minister? Do you think, sir, I bear nine day one that is a least trust and I say. Uh, um, why, why did they why be Theresa May? <laughs> and I said, the new prime minister of the UK, how how long do you think he is going to be in office? I and I'm say, oh dear, me, 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 I be kwa ku think that two a kra and free. Ah, your sponsors, your sponsors, other sponsors are in addition to certified accountants. Ah, your cover be a. Our very lives consist of moments, occasions, events, and experiences. But some of these moments turn out to be so special. That you never want to forgive them. Unfortunately, to forget is human, and time relegates all those special moments to antiquity. And that is when photography comes in to bring to the present memories of those special moments, occasions, and events which you cherish so so much. You don't just want photography; you want professional photography. Speak to the experts at Dan Studio UK. Firm of professional photographers providing on equal photography services to all areas in the UK. Let us take care of the photographs of those special occasions that mean so much to you. Is it a wedding, a christening, an engagement, a marriage ceremony, a birthday party, or is it a funeral celebration, a business event, a religious event, a political event? Or other social events, Adam Studios UK is your ultimate choice. Get in touch now for a professional photography service with a touch of spice. Adam Studios UK, 
incredible photographs that return those memories from antiquity to the present. Ebusiyofo, so keshi ni yao padia. Ema mkwanchen fubi ame se pictures ni mawu. Ubiti mika se I'm sorry. O pictures ni jina se. Contact Edan Studios UK on 078-52. Three one one zero four nine. That's zero seven eight five two three one one zero four nine. At Dan Studios UK for incredibly fabulous photographs. At Dan Studios UK naturally flawless. At Dan Studios UK. Incredible photographs with a touch of spice. spice, spice. I pray for Ghana for listen to Ohima B this and every Tuesday evening 8 p.m. to 9 p.m. UK time for our evening talk show. The man come on. Chewajin. Join the conversation. Family issues. Social issues. Awari munsem. Child upbringing. Abatayi munsem. A man titiye munsem. Fear shensem. A man masuka hu. Don't miss this show. This and every Tuesday evening 8 to 9 p.m. UK time. Listen to a man come on, on top online. Radio UK. You can watch the program live on Facebook at Top Online Radio UK. You can tune in to us by visiting our website www.toponlinestation.com or you can download our radio app directly from the Play Store or the App Store. You can also tune in to us on Modern Ghana Radio, Ghana Web Radio page, mytuna.com and all third party radio platforms. Join the conversation. What Jun Chen is saying, don't miss this show. This and every Tuesday, 8 to 9 p.m. UK time. Only on Top Online Radio UK. You don't want to miss this. Who is going to do my account and tax returns for me, Cra? Certified accountant. Certified accountant. Certified accountant. They will help you with your account and tax returns. Are you a medical driver, hairdresser, shop owner, or self-employed? Certified accountant. And then what's our with you? And then we will see when you will be a what bring accounts and tax returns more. Now bans are so more. Now who you are. It's in a make careful certified accountant at the Yamawo. F accounts and tax returns. Company accounts. Bookkeeping. Payroll services. Charity accounts. And gift aid claim. As of all, not 20. Home manager certified accountant. self tax planning. Business advice. Company registration. And many more. And if you should watch it, company. What you will cast. Now what you have to do. What is the capital of the bill? Certified accountant. Say say a batter self on the dia. What to wedding? Construction workers, agency workers, relief security workers, bank nursing staff, and then one year juma our temporary workplaces in a month frano. No one is a cabu do mamma. Media the amateur crown is a HM RC4 at the cabra work. What to move out a trim and yes, as well. What to so cry address. 335 to 351 Raynham Road South, Darknam, RM10 8QR. Telephone 0208 226 4933. Mobile 079 568 04517. Ah, certified accountant. Mehuma Mehua Chami. Mudim Puncio Abame Dumayum. Thinking of coming to Ghana now or later? Wondering where and how to go about your stay while in Ghana? Have you heard and want to experience Ghana from her food to music to culture to heritage and to tourist sites? Denilex Travel and Tours is ready to hold you down. Denilex Travel and Tours is your ultimate travel partner right from the airport to wherever your destination may be. Denilex is well equipped to handle your travel needs and be your guide throughout your stay in Ghana. Connect with us 
us on social media at Denilex underscore group or visit our website at www.denilexcompanylimited.com or call plus 233-744-431. The experience of Denilex Travel and Tours is always worth reliving. Try us. Denilex Travel and Tours, your ultimate travel partner. Next grill. Listen to DJ G and on Top Online Radio UK this and every Tuesday evening, 4 to 6 p.m. UK time. As he brings you in Next Grail. What's in the mix? It's really anything goes. Social issues. Cultural issues. Diaspora issues. Ghanaian issues. It really cuts across all the board. Listen to DJ G Nice this and every Tuesday afternoon, 4 to 6 p.m. UK time. Don't miss this show. Join the conversation. What's going on? Next prayer. Only on Top Online Radio UK. You can listen to this program live on Facebook and YouTube. Just search for Top Online Radio UK. You can also tune in live on our website. TopOnlineStation.com Download our free radio mobile app from the Play Store and the App Store. You can also get the download links from our website TopOnlineStation.com Don't miss the show. Join the chat. Join the conversation. Let's talk. Join TJT Live this and every Tuesday afternoon 4 to 6 p.m. UK Time. You don't want to miss this. This program is proudly sponsored by Certified Accountant Limited, a firm of Ghanaian accountants in the UK. You can reach them for all your accounting and tax matters on 0208-226-4933. That's 0208-226-4933. Or you can visit their website, certifiedaccountants.org. At Certified Accountant Dot all. DJ Unice twice as much. Nice. For DJ KBN Top Online Radio UK, I'm Jiri Subiano. You're gonna for more UK ham chat show and check us here. I'm the free Top Online Radio UK. So a brand on I come for why smart solicitors. I am among gonna follow your for more UK ha. I buy UK in Krata. Simu Mran Simu dia modi mo akutine pa NT. I say oh UK ha now here lawyers. Ama omu aye won krata sem ama wa become for wise smart solicitors ama o benyo mo 0208 016 5384 that is 0208 016 5384 i omo emergency mobile number so 079 314 that is zero seven nine three one four one one zero four two. Over to me, I send on my email or info at wisemartsolicitors.co.uk. That is info at wisemartsolicitors.co.uk. On my website, this is it www.wisemartsolicitors.co.uk. I am address in the Nyeri Rabakwa Omo Dosting, Unit A to Nine, the Print House, eighteen to twenty-two Ashwin Street, Dosting, London, E eight three D L, that is E eight three Delta Lima. Why smart for the Utu Omo Swa? No, sorry. Get in touch. DJ KBN top on audio consultancy and I tell me what you do giving a one of a kind a chance to shine that's the eBay way
کسی 